Question, why are these atheist fools over at Rational Wiki, why are they defending the Roman Catholic Church? They have an article here called Anti-Catholicism, I'll show you it this way. And they write here, I'll just zoom in so you can see better. While anti-Catholic bigotry was once, was once rampant amongst Protestants, the recent political realignments have strengthened ties between conservative Protestants and the Catholic hierarchy. Yeah, because the Protestants now are just yoked up with the Roman Catholicism. Increasingly, so-called anti-Catholicism is merely whining about criticism of the Church, you know. But they're calling it anti-Catholic bigotry. Um, from atheists? Why are atheists saying this? They have a section here called Wingnut Protestant Fundamentalists, and they write, Hardline fundamentalists still continue to claim the Pope is the Antichrist, which he is. Well, he's, I, I believe he's the false prophet of Revelation. But the Catholic Church is the seat of, a seat of the Antichrist, no doubt about that. And that Roman Catholics engage in satanic, demonic, occult, and otherwise unchristian practices. They do. Roman Catholicism is just repackaged witchcraft and repackaged paganism. Uh, the witchcraft movement is subservient to Roman Catholicism. The, uh, you know, you say, oh, well, during the Inquisition, they, the Catholic Church burned witches at the stake. Uh, no, they burned Christians at the stake and claiming, oh, they're witches. You know, right. I mean, again, they're trying to rewrite history. The Catholic Church, I mean, there's, um, I remember listening to a sermon by Jason Cooley, and I disagree with, with Jason Cooley on a lot of different issues, uh, in terms of, like, dispensationalism and that kind of stuff. But he, he actually pointed out that, there was this uh, satanic church, and in order to be a priest in, the, in that particular satanic church, you had to be a Roman Catholic priest first in order to get into that church, that satanic church. You know, Satanism is, is aligned with Roman Catholicism, obviously, no doubt about that. Uh, they write here a plus, equaling the church with the whore of Babylon, which it is, worship of Mary and the saints with idolatry, considering Catholicism a false religion, read basically paganism in disguise. Of course, all that comes in the mix of them not practicing a religion and other similar apologetic nonsense. You know, uh, and that e this even Protestant, sorry, this even if Protestant is an offshoot of that, he uses a number of, of conventions and ideas established by Catholicism. Yeah, because the thing about Protestants is that the Protestant Reformation, they were just trying to reform the Catholic Church. I mean, Luther, he protested abuses of Rome. He, he spoke out against a lot of the errors and heresies of Rome, but he was essentially just trying to reform the Catholic Church and, and change it. You can't reform something that God hates. Uh, and, they, of course, they attacked Chick Tracks, and I'm not a supporter of Chick Tracks. I, I've withdrawn my support over uh, them making, they're making gr these Catholic images of the Godhead. Um, and a, a bunch, of, bunch of other issues, and then you know uh, David Daniel saying that Jesus came in the flesh, all this other heretical nonsense. But they attack, attack Chick Tracks over their expose of Roman Catholicism. They write Chick Tracks uh, are repellent of evangelical hatred for the Church. One tract argues that the Catholic Church created Islam, communism, and Nazism, which they did. Uh, Islam, communism, and Nazism are just daughters of the harlot, Freemasonry, and more. Uh, and, and the thing about Freemasonry is that most Roman Catholic priests are just yoked with Freemasonry. Again, not going to not, not going to go through that in this video, but other brethren have brought that out. In fact, there are more Chick tracts that condemn the Catholic Church, and there are Chick tracts that condemn Mormonism, Islam, and Jehovah's Witnesses combined. I like how they call it crankery, you know. But here's the thing: why why are atheists defending Roman Catholicism? They're like anti-Catholic bigotry. Really, really weird. I mean, I thought I thought atheists opposed the Catholic Church. Let me show you some scripture. Uh, Psalms chapter 50, 53. Perfect description of atheists. Psalms 53, 1 to 3. The fool has said in his heart, actually, I'll do it this way. The fool has said in his heart, There is no God, corrupt are they, they have done abominable iniquity, there is none that doeth good. Perfect description of atheists, you know, with the communist movement and all this other stuff. God looked down from heaven upon the children of men to see if there were any that did understand and that did seek God. Every Verse 3, every one of them has gone back. They are altogether become filthy. There is none that doeth good, no, not one. Perfect description of, of these atheist fools over at Rational Wiki, who just attack people personally. And if you try to bring out like a lawsuit against them, they'll just satire, all this other stuff. Psalms 14.1, the fool has said in his heart, there is no God. They are corrupt, they have done abominable works, there is none that doeth good. The Lord looked down from heaven upon the children of men to see if there were any that did understand and, and seek God. They are all gone aside, they are all together become filthy, there is none that doeth good, no not one. Again, perfect description of these atheist fools over at this website, Rational Wiki. Defending Roman Catholicism, they, they defend, you know, they, 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 they call out, quote, Islamophobia, they call out, you know, um, 
attacks against the the wicked antichrist religion of Judaism. And when I when I say that Judaism is wicked, I'm not saying that from a hatred of the Jewish people. I mean, obviously they need to get saved, but I'm saying that in the sense that Judaism denies that Jesus is that Jesus Christ is come in the flesh, which qualifies it for being an antichrist religion. Because if you don't confess that Jesus Christ is come in the flesh, you're an antichrist according to scripture. So I like I've done I have done here anti-Catholic Stephen Anderson, uh, Glenn Beck, John Calvin, Jack Chick, uh, Steve Drain. I like how they have their Brian Dellinger, you know, Westboro Baptist Church, Fred Phelps, Ian Paisley, Tex Mars. Funny they they Tex Mars died back in November, but they don't have him deceased or whatever. Funny John Hagee, uh, John MacArthur, Alex Jones, David Icke, Martin Luther. Yeah, it's just weird. Why are atheists defending? their Catholic Church. Really, really weird. So, don't be deceived by atheism. It's it's just a, a sect of Roman Catholic. It's it just, it, the most athe the Catholic Church is yoking up with atheism. So, don't be deceived. God bless you. Goodbye.